Hi, it's me again with Corel Raw Tips and Tricks. I just did a video on making this like this rainbow text. And I started thinking while that other video was loading, this would be a really good, because you're going to, most evidently, they're going to print this. So instead of having good sharp colors, let's, uh, let's just do this twice. Let's bring this to the front of the page. And let's intersect this. Make sure we grab it all and intersect it and let's move that out of the way and you can kind of see that. Now let's move our text out of the way and let's take this and we'll go to bitmap and convert it to a bitmap. I'm working in RGB so I'm going to keep it RGB. That's already going to fuzzy it up just a hair but what you can also do is take it and go to effects. Now that it's a bitmap you can blur it and we're going to use Gaussian blur and We'll move the window out of the way and we'll blur it a little bit. Because you're going to print this, let's blur it up a little bit more. I think this would be a cool effect, maybe. So now let's do this and intersect it. And let's look at the difference. See if we can see any noticeable. Can't really... Can't, you know, there's a definite between the purple and the red. A little bit more per Well, I could have placed it in the wrong place, too. So I'm, I'm going to say this is a wash. Um, you know, there, I wish I would have made sure I was in the... I think I'm pretty close to the right place. This one looks like it's got a... This was the original. It's got like a curve of the uh, sharpness of the line. We're here at dozen. It's got more of a, just kind of a faded color. So maybe, maybe it does help a little bit. Let's uh, let's back up here, and let's let's uh, blurry this again, and just see what happens. And because it's a bitmap, is the only reason you can blur it. And we blur it. Let's blur a little bit more. Well, that's too much, but it could be a cool effect. Now let's intersect it. Grab the whole thing. You've got to, well, let me move that over. Make sure you grab the whole thing. Tell you what, I wanted to move this out of the way, move this out of the way so I can grab the whole thing and go to intersect. Now let's see what it looks like compared to the original. Not that big a deal. Maybe not even as sharp of colors because it's kind of blended the colors in. So I, I like the original better, but you can actually see the curvature of the of my pattern. And I could have done a blend um, type deal with, with a rectangle too and not have this curvature. But that's just another idea on how to get to something. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.